Hey guys, Scrap It's back, and what we're going to talk about today is big, ugly, low grade circuit boards. Some of you might recognize this as something that this would come out of a TV. This is a pretty typical um, circuit board that you get out of a um, tube TV, an old style TV. So you have all sorts of things on here. You have um, aluminum heat sinks on here, you have copper bearing items, you have transformers on here um, I don't remember what this is called exactly, this big piece here but there is copper in this thing, I'll get to that at the end of the video so, and then of course just a pile of junky computer wire so I'm going to show you what you can do with this thing rather than just throw it in your uh, in your tin shred or you know leave them behind or whatever you do with them so my scrapyard I'm just telling you what I can do with my scrapyard I, I don't know about yours I get 10 cents a pound if I threw it just like this okay threw it in there just like this so let's see what this thing registers at So this is uh, six pounds, and just over six pounds. So I would get 60 cents if I just turn this thing in just like that. So I'm going to stop this thing, and I'm going to scrap this all out, pile it all up, and show you what you can get out of it, and tell you roughly how long it took me and all that kind of stuff. And then you get an idea if you want to do it. All right, back in a little bit. Okay, so we're back. And before I get to what we got here, this thing that's on almost every tube TV. I don't know exactly what it is. Um, I, I, I knew once and I don't remember anymore. There is copper in this thing. Um, most of the time you take all this stuff off and there's copper sheets in between paper or plastic sheets and then it's copper sheet and then it's you know round and round, layered, layered, layered. They're a giant hassle to take apart. Um, some yards will give you copper motor for this you can ask so if, if they give you copper motor it's worth taking this part off of there if they don't I would just leave it on the board or throw it in with your tin shred stuff so um, I don't take them off my yard won't buy them this way um, and then on most TVs you will end up with a little a board with a little IC chip on it but it'll just go as a low grade board and I'm not worried about taking that thing off of there so anyway this thing took me about five minutes to take apart. And let's see how much of the board is left here. There we go. Anyway, so here's what's left of the board. Two pounds, 6.6 .6 ounces on there. So now the board's worth 25 cents, something along those lines. Okay, so that would just go in with my boards ended up with a couple of transformers at 3.3 ounces so that's not bad I don't take part transformers but I will pop this uh, this copper outer layer off of there we ended up with 2.6 ounces of these small copper bearing items they would take them as um, transformers for me but I will, uh, but I strip those things, I strip the copper out of those, they're super easy to do, and like I said before, I'll make another video of that. Let's see, we ended up with some copper, or some aluminum heat sinks, about 7.7 .7 ounces. Um, there's a few little things I need to, to strip off of those things, but that's about what you get out of that. Um, a couple of just a little miscellaneous items, just a little tiny bit of brass. A little bit of copper, um, a little of those, uh, the heat sink, copper heat sink connectors. So I hang on, those are take a half of a second to pull off of there, so I do that. And then we ended up with about a half a pound or five ounces of junky computer wire out of this thing. So that's what, that's all the wire that was on that thing. And then some of it ended up in the garbage, little chunks and pieces and things that just broke off. I'm not going to worry about stacking up with that stuff. So 
is it worth taking apart? I think that they definitely are, but you can decide. And uh, thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.